Boys and girls, we're getting ready. We're trying to figure out how we're going to do this double header today. We've got this volleyball game. We've got the hot dog and cornhole cookout. <laughs> We've got a football game tonight. It would be an interesting one. Let's do one tonight. Oh, yeah. Tell the things. I know we get to support Lady Devils and Red Devils at the same time. Absolutely. Let's get ready, folks. It's going to be midnight TLCS Eagles and the Lady of Red Devils at Rankin. Going at it, and tonight we're going to see some action. Two of the rising stars out here in West Texas. Water Valley team coming along really good, and then the ranking team just surprising the world. Coming along great. It's going to be a heck of a matchup that we can see that tonight. Thank you. 
going through the video. Oh, I'm not sure. I didn't see, but I think Jaden here is a seven, so you can. And if Jade comes up, she can go see them. So, Ward starts with the stairs to chase him at the back corner. Now, we talked to Ward about what is going on to break her sister's serving record of 19. She is number two on the list. And not going to get an opportunity here, as that one's going to be out of bounds by the Red Bulls. Foul three. Let's set this out of Jordan's hand here. Five four is score number twelve coming up. So hey, you got a kid playing uh, football tonight. Football man, ranking Texas quarterback, very soon position. Does that make you a little nervous? <laughs> of course it does. <laughs> of course it does. And that's going to be out of bounds. Five five. I think any sports man or regardless of male or female position, big game, little game, you're always nervous when it gets bad. Oh, they got to work for Bobby and Templeton here. She said that the uh, Wicked Valley's got a band, so we're going to have two bands on the field tonight. So for, for those of you who like band, it's going to be a heck of a night in football. Oh, they're going to have
go ahead and look down to our CIA print for the Lady Brothers. Addison Aguilar coming up with the song. She's going to send it over. Well, oh, it's not going to talk about that. It's not going to talk about that. It's not going to talk about that. And you know the coach over here recognizes the thing. Okay, Pete. Okay. Please, do you recognize the coach? She's the one at the top now that always has like a really big hairstyle. Oh, yeah, for sure. Now that you said that, I do recognize that. She's a, a good top coach out there. Always encouraging. You can take a stand in one side of the girls as well. So that's going to be 14 to 9. I just noticed some of the boys out here in their jerseys looking good in their red leather jerseys rocking around. For sure. And uh, 14 to 9 is a score. We'll take a quick break here. We'll be back up to 40 seconds. Number 22, Aguilar with the serve. She's going to be a couple of inches out past the line. And Midland TLCO making a game of it. Pretty big comeback here. That's him. 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 Yeah. 
the left hand holder. One meter in the middle, what a flip shot. Oscar Hunter was right there, standing over there. Don't break that one. That's a left shot, that's what I said. A left hand is so well. A left hand is so well. A left hand is so well. Jordan Ward with the stand, right back point for the Lady Red Devils. Good looking sets up by the Red Devils, that's the holder with the stand, Tim Green on the edge of three. A quick bit movement by the Lady Devils, so I get myself in the place thing. 20 to 14. And here we go, one more time, Jordan Ward. And Midland's just going to dump that over the top. Jordan underneath. Aguilar with the set. Dead meter. <laughs> yes, you know, I exaggerated a lot. That is two rows from the top there. <laughs> if I can get down for four, dead meter is knocking that thing over to at least 55 miles an hour right now. So it's going to get a ticket on my back. Two rows from the top. Wow, goodness. Jordan Ward hits him with a hard shot there. Midland's going to try to get it over. Not able to. 22 14. See if Jordan can close this one out. Just three points away from set. And he's at the black line. Oh, a little thick shot. Good movement there by Oscar. A little ball meter. With the over the top shot. Standing with the same. There's Aguilar. That's the other. And we've got a scramble going on. <laughs> That's a looking good one. Oh, oh, finally, she sent that to the back corner and no one was out. They have no handbag at the back door, so they still got in. 23 to 14. Jordan with the shot. Oh, good spot. Aguilar's right there. Dead man are underneath. And then you notice a lot of the guys are going back with the buck shot instead of trying to two hand it because they're getting caught with the two flexes. Is that how? Yeah. Little flex thing. But that's what I do. But I'm not a broadcaster. Oh, she's around Jimmy over here. Did you make Jimmy? I'm sorry. Wow.
Vamos ao Rodrigo Gomes.
trying to get the girls back in the game down there. And oh, end of the month, seven steps. And this is going to bring up the senior game leader. There's this good, good looking curveball over the top. Little giddy trap there by Midland. Game leader from the quarter into Nashville. Eight to six. And Lincoln sliding up. So game leader with a second stop. Testing in low. Good dig there by Midland. Rivera's there. Aguilar seven. Right underneath, Edison setting up Barrow. Just going to get it over. Both teams grab the rock. Oh, oh, it's tough. Oh, 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 now, how many cars about in from right here? Uh, but I have a video that lets me ride on the road. Lincoln and Matt Stay. Now, Ralph's got coming up to see. You'll see, you've got no cars. Good foot there. And pretty good at sight. Pretty good at sight. Pretty good at sight. Pretty good at sight. And it's Tim to see. And then we have Rivera back to the back line for the third. And then from Rivera, she comes over here to the left side. Right behind the center from the left side. Different look for him. Spike there, Rivera with the dig. Aguilar digs it out. Sermon throws it to the back. And then Rivera with the dig. Oh, and little, little bit of defense there by the red ball. It was Aguilar's set. Aguilar it's one minute with the back court spike. And it is wrong. Good luck about the way he goes there, keeping that in and making some adjustments. He's not quite able to get the point. Um, what about battle here? Team to three. This young lady's been playing the foot line really well for Midland PLTA. Let's see what she does on the stair. Tick, 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 tick. A little bit of a hold up here, a rotation check. And that's Lauren to the back line. And loving the heat. We're going to bring up Edison Angular to the starting line. Edison good serve in the middle. Two minutes. And this is Edison giving a lot of trouble. This boy is popping out of the rock line every so often. Now, give it a chance to look here. Bringing some good energy, so maybe they'll get that on the field tonight, too. Red Riley getting in the show, and they did almost have the win against Ben Henry. Oh, good job by Kate and Freya with the play play. Think about this for the game tonight. Westbrook beats Rankin. Rankin loses, oh, uh, Rankin? Oh, uh, Westbrook beats Rankin. Bloody Vista beats Westbrook. Red Riley almost beats Bloody Vista. So we're going to have a little bit of time back for it tonight. Close. I think Rankin's been going to run up for the past few weeks, but really when you look at it and look at games and whatnot, six points for places are really close when it comes to running football. So anybody's, anybody's opportunity to get to the state game this year. Who mm -hmm. wants it, right? I think it's uh, what it comes down to. What's the really like the state emergency? They don't have a whole lot of competition in there, you know, like the post game, but over here, man, going up north. 
you've got happy, you've got right face, you've got baby, you've got right face. There's a ton of competition that's really closely evenly matched. I think right now is even making a little push right now. I think so. I think they're second in the state and they've slept there for a few weeks. That's why I was fine. And on the other hand, you've got Abbott. Yeah. And who runs around this bar? Oh, uh, yeah. And then, of course, number one. Who's that? Gordon? No, I've never heard of him. My friend over there? I think I've heard Gordon and Abbott still have heard of him to be a great man. Talking about ranking, he's really got us getting ready to hunt into District Action in a few weeks. And uh, they will face the number 17th currently, number 17th marathon. Oh, did they move him out of the top 10 finally? They are, they are number 17, and so they're in our district. And Lady Doubles will hit them the Saturday after the BB game. So we'll have um, Boys BB Football Friday night, band area competition Saturday morning, and then Lady Doubles District Big Game on Saturday night at 7 p.m. Oh, wow, how do we know that? We'll make it. But how? How? Okay. Magic skills. Ooh, it must be me laying outside. 16 to 10, here's the score. We need, we need to get a little red right rub. We need to get a lean red devil in there so we can pick up some points for the red devils. See who they said that? And that's what it'll be. Yeah, they're not even going to do it right here. So they can keep it on out. 16 to 10. There are no records to be had on the board, but some quick throws in there. Back in the back end. TLCA with a spike. It's not by the Red Devils. They need to play a good defense here. Yes. 17 to 10. Come on, keep it rolling. Lady Devils run in a little bit. Keep on running. Bad man, keep on turning. Jordan slaps that to the back end. The spikes down, I can always make food. That's right! I love that with the wood tab. Oh, it's a good wood tab. 18 to 10, Jordan Wood. Second throw, the third throw. Spikes down, back run. Ooh, the back, the summer. We don't want to hit that back right now. Like, just kind of let that go. We're going to still need her for this freaking playoff. That's how we're. 18 to 11. Yeah, we're going to keep making some changes. Grab the line changes going on in the middle of the game. I think it's going to make me rock by Ray West for a minute. Is that how it came out? He's in the third. He's in the third. For the Eagles, 18 to 12. I mean, we started this in the first inning. He was trying to make a game of it. Over the top. Oh, Jordan not able to get the guy. That's right down the line. Oh, I think that one has to No, he got the line right there. And, and we were getting up a little slow right there. 18 13 in school. And I think that hip has been hurt ever since he hit that bar earlier. Maybe. Number four, Kira gets a little cheap shot back over the top. Spikes that, Aguilar's there. Very near. Sucks up the red. The red lab all over the side over the top. Point red doubles. 19 13. Once again, with a shot there, Reagan Pilato, you're a good snap. Got a good over. Good opportunity, good crowd there by uh, Lesla. Not by uh, Bella. 19-14. And that is way low. Into the coach's office. 20-14. Absolutely. Oh, you got that. It's not my baby. I don't need to mess up with this thing. I'm 